Now that all the important people are here, let's get down to business. Akavi, what have you got? Based on intelligence provided by Mandalore, I was able to narrow my search and scout potential suppliers to Hedda Cole and her group, the Hidden Chain. Hedda's targets, outer rim colonies and transports on the Rim of Trade route, point to powerful trade houses shutting down their competition with her guns. Those will likely be our suppliers. I have advised Jakaya Ordo, and he is marshalling Mandalore's fleet as a precaution. You'll find everything I uncovered in my report. Okay, we'll get our analysts on that. Good work. Is there anything else? We have a message from the Imperial Reclamation Service. An associate of Darth Rivix may have found a lead on the relic Malgus stole on Dantooine. Colonel Barton Gola, at your service. I've been asked to relay a high-priority message concerning records my team discovered during a recent assignment, which I'm also forwarding to you. These files are old. Very old. They almost went straight to central processing, but Darth Rivix has insisted that I personally comb through any new finds. I uncovered a cargo manifest that mentions a containment apparatus exactly like the one you described in your Dantooine Enclave report. Regrettably, many of the manifest details are illegible. We couldn't identify the relic Malgus stole, but we did learn that it belonged to a Sith named Darth Null. It isn't much, but I do hope this information can be of use. If the files from Colonel Gola are any indication, our allies in the Empire believe this lead could be the key to locating Darth Malgus. Darth Rivix reports that he's identified one of Null's holdings. Darth Krovos has deployed her own forces to investigate it. I don't like how many decisions are being made without consulting us. I will relay your concerns to Darth Rivix. I'm sure he will do whatever he can to remedy them. In the meantime, there is something we can investigate ourselves. What am I seeing? This is where Darth Null's relic was first discovered. There are not many who know this planet. It is in a dark region of wild space. A dangerous, untamed world. If your intention is to investigate the source of this relic, you must send someone strong to this place. Someone who knows this region of the galaxy. I suggest Arkin. I won't speak for my colleagues in the Empire, but I can't imagine they will be thrilled at the idea of the former Eternal Emperor handling this. A valid concern, but ultimately the decision is yours, Commander. Sana Rey is right. Arkin is the best choice for this mission. We'll deal with any consequences later. Arkin should be adequately prepared. I will speak with him and share everything I know about his destination. That would be appreciated. Then it sounds like we all have our marching orders. Until next time. You must be a Carvey Spa. That's correct. I understand you recommended me for this mission. I appreciate the chance to help with Mandalore's hunt. We needed someone on the ground familiar with Mandalorian ways. You were right to send me. Those who supply had a coal are paranoid and prone to disappear. It is only because I am Mandalorian that I got as close as I did. The suppliers are very much afraid of Hedda's wrath should they disappoint her, or worse, reveal any of her secrets. She's being very careful. Her ruthless reputation and a seemingly endless supply of credits from her raids means she can keep her secrets. Her suspected suppliers in my report are scattered across the galaxy. We find them, we hurt her. This sounds promising. You have given us the advantage. Praise isn't necessary. It was my duty. Until Mandalore herself calls on me to strike her enemies down, I will continue this work. But I should get back to helping your analysts go through my report. Find her weakness, Akavi. That is the only thing that matters. <laughs> <laughs>